San Diego police say a taco shop owner in the South Crest area shot a man who tried to rob him this morning. Investigators also believe the same guy was responsible for two armed robberies in National City just an hour or two earlier. Fox 5's Jacqueline Sarkeesian has that. Within a couple of hours, there were three armed robberies in National City. The first incident happened at 9th and C Avenue around 7.40 in the morning. The victim had just taken out cash from an ATM at the Bank of America and was walking home. That's when a Hispanic man got out of a black Acura and pulled out a handgun, taking all the victim's cash. Shortly after that, about an hour or so later, we got a second call of a robbery at a liquor store on the other side of the city. It actually turns out that there was a silver gun also involved in that robbery and the suspect description kind of matched the, the initial first robbery. National police say they then received a third call of another robbery at the swap meet. Eventually we were able to get a license plate number for that uh, for the suspect vehicle and we were able to possibly track down that vehicle or track down the location of possibly where the vehicle was at. That information was released to surrounding agencies and shortly after San Diego police called saying there was a shooting at a taco shop in the South Crest area matching the suspect's description. It's kind of scary, yeah. Hopefully it doesn't happen again. Manuel Zavala lives just down the street from where the shooting took place. He says he's lived in the neighborhood for about 10 years, but it's not the same. Recently, I think there's been more crime than since we first got here. Police say the suspect is in his early 20s and entered the taco shop demanding money from two cash registers. The owner complied, and as the suspect was leaving, he shot him twice. Reporting from South Crest, Jacqueline Sarkeesian, Fox 5 News.